The new Silent King model is here, and apparently there's a hidden secret within the teaser trailer. It's coming right up. Necrons. Nick speaking and welcome to this video. Right, another video for you on Necrons and today we are looking at the teaser trailer for The Silent King. We now have a sense of what this model is going to be like, sort of. So what you just saw was the trailer for The Silent King. However, it's just a teaser trailer and I have to be honest, I was very disappointed that that was all we got. Actually, it was the most disappointing thing about the reveals. You can't really see a great deal of this model. I know they did a teaser trailer for Thracker previously, but I really wasn't expecting a preview like that. Stop the press whilst editing and saving this video we had an image of the Silent King come out and it's a nice sharp image. Now the audio at the end of this video is about the previously leaked blurry image. However, I'm going to be showing you the sharp image as I talk about it. Right, let's get on and see if we can find this hidden message. However, that's what we got and apparently there is a secret hidden within this trailer. So, let's have a closer look at the trailer. Okay, so this is the first thing that we see in the trailer. We've got some what looks to be canoptic triarch type legs. And then of course some wiring. Now that wiring is quite different to what we're used to. With some small green tubes going down the wire. So we know we've got a new concept in terms of the design. We can see a couple of orbs there of course as well. But that's it from the first picture. I can't see any hidden secrets in that clip. So this is the second clip and again it's quite difficult to really make too much out. We've got some legs there right at the top and of course this looks to be crackled broken type armour I suppose indicating that the Silent King has been around a long time and actually that pattern looks very similar to the teaser trailer that something was coming for Necrons that they previously did. Looks pretty cool, it's quite a dark colour scheme, that green is a new green, we've not seen that before for Necrons, but again I can't see any hidden secrets there. Now the next image shows us some wiring again and on the right hand side a big what looks like, like a shield of some description with obviously a massive orb. Now we're going to talk more about the leaked images of this particular miniature later in the video but for now just looking at this image there's not that much there. Again we can see someone behind that shield potentially holding up a little staff uh, but no hidden secrets that I can see. Right, so the next image we've got what looks like steps and then the bottom of maybe what looks like a cloak. I can't really see much more than that with this image. Again, it's very interesting how subdued and dark the paint scheme is for this particular model. It's quite different to what we've seen previously. Okay, so the next image appears to be the top of that staff that we saw earlier and we've got that black stone design in between the staff which Illuminor is also carrying on his shoulder. That is quite interesting, maybe there is a connection there. And underneath that we appear to have a new symbol. It's very difficult to see that symbol here but it looks like a Necron symbol almost with something intertwined with it. Now the section on the left hand side of that picture, again it's quite difficult to work out what that is. Maybe that's the thing that's holding up that big shield that we saw earlier in the picture. We've got some Necron symbols on that piece and again I don't think I recognise all of those symbols so maybe it's just indicating the new dynasty. 
And once again, even that staff is painted a lot more subdued than we're used to. The green isn't very bright. Again, it could just be the colours of the new dynasty, or it could just be a new direction that Games Workshop are taking Necrons in, in terms of their aesthetics. Okay, so this is the next clip, and we've got the bottom of a staff next to some legs and some form of overlord type tabard. Could that be an overlord or maybe one of the Silent King's uh, guards, possibly? And then on the left hand side, we've got what appears to be another model, maybe another guard. Don't think that's the actual Silent King himself because he appears to be tapping in some commands into a console, almost like a driver, almost like a command barge section. There does appear to be a new symbol on his front there. I don't think I've seen that before, but I could be wrong. If you know what that symbol is, or if you know anything which I'm talking about so that I've said that's wrong, then let me know in the comments box below because obviously I would love to hear your thoughts. Is there a hidden secret in this clip? I don't know, maybe it's something to do with that symbol. I'm not sure. Okay, so next up is the top half of what I think is the guy on the right hand side. Again, he's on like a command section. So I think there's two guys in command sort of seats next to the Silent King. So is that the Silent King's cloak there just on the left? These pictures are very mysterious. I don't think we're actually seeing much of the king himself. Okay, so here it is. This must be the Silent King himself because I don't think any of those drivers have their hands out, if I'm not mistaken, and that appears to be the cloak that we've previously seen. So I'm assuming that this is him. It's quite interesting that he's got some Necron symbols there on his forearm, almost like a tattoo. They appear to be on his legs as well. We've never seen that on any Necron model before. And then we've got what looks to be a rear picture of the top of his cloak. Pretty cool. Interesting that they've gone for a silver colour on his cloak. Just introducing a little bit of green there. Again though, I can't see any secrets hidden within these pictures, which according to Games Workshop, there is a secret message somewhere within this teaser trailer. Okay, so the next picture is this guy standing there in the middle with the cloak and of course he's got his guard to his left. So you can see his waist comes up to the height of the guy on the right, so he's roughly twice the size of a normal Necron. He doesn't look particularly big, but maybe he's not supposed to be that big, maybe it's the whole model itself. Obviously, it's going to be some sort of throne diorama type model. It's going to make the whole model bigger without making the Silent King, like, huge. So next is just a close-up image of one of those drivers again, so not much there. And then we've got a close-up picture of the shield thing. I'm just calling it a shield for now. And then another closer picture of the other guy on the other side. None of those have their hands out, so presumably that hand is the Silent King's hand. And then next we've got this image here, which is one of the most exciting things about the whole of this release. This guy at the top, which of course looks like a Catan. He looks as if he's trapped within that Blackstone circle. And as we come to the final image of the trailer, Look at that, how cool does that look? I am totally loving that image there. I am really looking forward to painting it. However, from all of those images, I can't see any secret message. Maybe I'm blind, maybe you've got it, maybe it's right in my face. If it is, let me know in the comments box below what you think the secret message is. So like I said, it was a bit disappointing. We didn't see the whole of the model. However, there is a leaked image of this model. However, it's very, very blurry, but it does give us an idea of what it's going to look like. So at the top there, you can clearly see the captured Catan, which is just an awesome piece to the whole model itself and we can see the two shields are actually very big either side of what appears to be his throne. Those shields do not seem to be attached to it so maybe they're his like wound markers maybe you have the two shields there 
you take wounds and the shields go first before you start targeting the Silent King himself. We're going to have a look at all of the leaked images in another video, but for now though, let me know what you think of the Silent King model. And if you're new to the channel and you want to learn about Necrons and more, then please subscribe and hit the bell button to turn on all notifications so you don't miss an upload. Beam me up. <laughs>